I'll wait for my brother to pass, and then I'll leave. No, uh, no, no. This is your room. I'll be done in a minute. No need to rush. This is, this will be your room eventually. You're not going. I have to. She needs me. She always needs you, just like she always needs Atticus. When will you realize that something is not right with her? I'm tired of your nonsense, Carissa. I'm going. And I don't have to listen to you. I'm getting wrong. You want me to bring you some home? Yes. Those two are really close. Yeah. Ever since Clarissa was first adopted. So... When you said... This will be your room eventually? Did you mean... Yeah. I agreed to the marriage. Yeah. I agreed to the marriage. What about Anya? Well, I can't hurt the woman I love. And I can't run away from my responsibility. You can... You can make it work. You think so? Yeah. The fact that you're willing to sacrifice your happiness for your duty shows how much of a leader you are. I love... I admire that about you. You know, Autumn, it's strange, but... You know, how I'm feeling right now, it feels right. I am really happy to hear that. Yeah. I am going to be your wife now. So the least I can do is be there to comfort you. Well, there is something else, though. What is that? I don't know. Um, I'll be out in a minute. I'll, uh, I'll turn around while you change, okay? Oh. Okay. Yep. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. That's it. Yep. Oh, oh, a little less. A little less. Great. Okay. Mr. Fawn, why don't you lean in and give Autumn a big smooch, huh? When it... <laughs> Excuse me? No, I'm just saying, you know, groom kissing a bride shows love, no? Yeah? Hey, come on, guys. Love birds. Can you give me something? Please. What? Man, for a couple that didn't want to kiss it for us, you guys sure perform magic. <laughs>
They must know the Fawns don't play when it comes to things like that. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for agreeing to come on this work trip with me. I uh, would have picked you up after I got the ring, but uh, I don't know. I thought you'd be interested. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, I didn't even think about a ring. And work trip. You're on a witch hunt, aren't you? Yeah. Oh! That's some... Um, the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Uh... Atticus? Yeah. Will you put it on me? <laughs> um... <clears throat> I don't know how my parents would feel about their daughter-in-law wearing some random ring found in a witch's circle, so... No one needs to know. Don't you think it's beautiful? You know, I, I believe that you should have the ring that matches you perfectly. If you think that's right, I'll put it on. Are you sure? <laughs> okay. Keep this a secret, especially for my parents, okay? See that? Yeah. It was made for me. Are you okay? Are you hurt? No, yeah, I'm okay. Um, it just, it seemed to want to take my hand off. <sighs> Who was that? I don't recognize it as the wolf of anyone I know. Let me take you home. I need to tell my father about this. Should we enhance security along the border? We can always enhance security. But what matters is where it appeared. I mean, there has to be a logical explanation. We can search for anyone with an injured leg, exactly like that black wolf. Tell me, what else was near or in the circle? Nothing. You were with Autumn that night, weren't you? Get me a list of people with leg injuries. Yes, sir. It's a good thing it's not infected. Otherwise, you'd have to wear bandages on your wedding day. <laughs> I cannot believe that it's happening tomorrow. I just, I just keep waiting for something to ruin a wedding plan, you know? It's going to happen, Autumn. No! No! Please, make the sound stop! I didn't mean to hurt her! Arr! One last favor for me. Can't see you until the wedding, and your mother's already on the island helping prepare, so you'll take a ride with my family. Is that okay with you? Yeah, I love your family. Um, 
Where are we going again? Green Harden Island. The Fawns own the place, and per the tradition, we have to get married and, you know, spend a night in a secret place. <laughs> <laughs> Secret's killing me. <laughs> Just you wait. Anya! I've given you enough time to realize your betrayal. No, Anya, I've... You know I would never, like, intentionally ruin your relationship. I, if our parents weren't in the way. <laughs> you think I don't know how long you've been infatuated with Atticus? You think I don't know how happy you are you finally get your chance with him? Anya, I have kept my distance from Atticus. For you. <laughs> and you know what? Even from that distance, I could see how betrayed he was when he saw you with his brother. If you love him, don't you think you should try letting him go? <laughs> <clears throat> A mistress can surely talk. You just admitted it. You've always wanted him for yourself. You couldn't stand. He's always wanted me. <laughs> well, I have news for you. No matter what he says, Atticus will always love me. No matter what you do, it will never be good enough. When he kisses you, he wishes there were my lips. When he sleeps with you at night, I'm the one he thinks about. Remember my warning. This is not a marriage. You're gonna turn into each other's worst nightmare. Crazy. Autumn, we're here. <gasps> Do it. I'm gonna be at your wedding every step of the way. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure it turns into a disaster. You can count me. My Luna. Have you seen Autumn's new ring? Yes. It's beautiful. <laughs> yes, it is. But, uh, I hear it brings bad omens. Are you sure that's fitting for a wedding day? I hear it brings bad omens. Are you sure that's fitting for a wedding day? It's not up to you to decide when it's not even your wedding, Anya. What do you mean it brings bad omens, dear? Well, wasn't it found in the woods by the witch's circle? What are you saying, that Atticus didn't buy her the ring? What's your evidence? Here, look at this photo, okay? Look at her finger. She wasn't wearing it the last time I saw her. And I checked with the local jewelry store. Atticus and Autumn were never there. So she must have found it in the woods, no? How did you... Oh, get this photo? You mean? My alpha. You, uh, <clears throat> you had sent some men over to our house with this photo. Looking for a so-called man with a, an injured leg. And, well, <laughs> they took one look at my mother with her walking stick and decided that she must be the black wolf. And they took her into custody. Judging from all of your expressions, you had no idea the poor misfortune my mother faced. Huh. How could you? After all, sweet Autumn made sure that all you could care about was her and her marriage to Atticus. Next in line, Alpha. But, uh, no one would notice if a certain injustice occurred here or there. But, uh, no one would notice if a certain injustice occurred here or there. I'm sure it was a misunderstanding. I'll have my men release your mother. <laughs> Thank you. See? <laughs> Two mysteries solved in one car ride. Now isn't that great? Dear, it's Atticus's fault he didn't buy the proper ring for you. But I do wish in the future you would be honest with us about things like this. No, oh my Luna, I swear to you, it was not intentional. Please don't blame Atticus. I, I asked him to put it on me. Okay, dear, just get to the dressing room.
Аня. In a perfect world, I'd marry you in a heartbeat. Family, duty requires a very autumn. I don't have a choice. I know all that. How am I supposed to watch my mate marry another woman? Well, if you made a decision between me and my brother, we wouldn't be in this situation right now. Are you blaming me for this? How was I supposed to know Moon Goddess would choose both you and your brother to be my mate? It's been a, a long day. I don't want Autumn to love you the same way that I do. Can you promise me something? Not to hold her? Touch her? The same way you are with me? These are promises I can't make you. Or yet I marry Autumn today. I can promise you. I will never love her as I love you. I can promise to never take her to bed. To never sleep with her. That is the best I can do for you, my mate. Why have you always been so perfect? And why do I have to lose you? Come on. I'll walk you out. I shouldn't be surprised, should I? Shouldn't you be surprised, should I? I saw her going in Atticus's room and I knew she was here to steal the man. Thank goddess I informed Autumn, otherwise we'd miss such a good show. Clarissa, your brother and I are mates. You shouldn't talk to us like that. Close your damn mouth, woman. What enough of the chaos you bring to our family. You know it's shame to see you cause nothing but heartbreak to literally everyone around you. Everyone leave me in autumn. Atticus, please. Please. Did you hear anything I said? That's your first question? Autumn. No, I didn't. I don't want to. What does that mean? It means this isn't working. Atticus, clearly, you love her. And you don't love me. This marriage is just going to be a burden on you. But it won't be a burden to you. Do you want me to find a way to stop this wedding? Do you want me to cause a scene? Sir, this is your last chance. Sir, this is your last chance. Oh, we are not doing this for our benefits. Okay, I'm not going to ask you to turn against your family for me, but we are getting married today for our families. Do you agree? It's bad luck to see the bride on our wedding day. I guess we've had enough bad luck already today, haven't we? More bad things are going to happen. I know it. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.
all mercy in this world just hunger thirsty persons in different versions each do what they that shit worsens why pull back the curtain and you'll see the different vermin we all have different burdens that all seem to cut <laughs> do me a favor anya anya are you okay anya 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 are you okay can you hear me anya Uh, we need to get her to the hospital right now. Hold on. Okay. Go for it. You know, I don't usually drink. But tonight, it um, feels enough. Mm -hmm. Autumn, you should do what you want. What Atticus did today was unacceptable, and you need to show him that. <laughs> I've been too nice, haven't I? More than you know. If you keep giving in to Atticus's feelings, he's going to think it's always okay to treat you this way. Mm hmm On the wedding? Oh! Only the bride gets to touch her husband. Autumn. Hey! You're right. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, Atticus! Get her off you this oh. minute! You're poor. Anya, get out of here, okay? <sighs> Drink the water, bottom. <sighs> Are you mad at me? No, I'm just worried about you. <laughs> I'm so happy. Just lean lean back. Okay, don't move. You know, I mean, why did you do that, Autumn? You know, hey, you're lucky me and Ani were the only ones who saw you. You know why I did I have no idea. I don't know. How would I know? <laughs> you got it all wrong. Drink the water. No. Drink the water, Autumn. Don't treat me like the reason why I'm doing it. 